Hello and good afternoon, everyone. Adam here at Kenyon Classic Cars in Clarence, Iowa. This afternoon, well, it's evening now, I guess, but anyway, we're going to show you this 1959 Ford Skyliner. Now, this car is red, as you can tell, and it has a multicolored red, white, and black interior in it, which is all factory. This car has a 352 underneath the hood with the charismatic transmission. Car runs and drives very well. Very nice car. Underneath this car is super solid. Car's never had any patch panels in it that I can see. Seems to have all the original sheet metal on it. Now these cars are very, very desirable cars and they are getting hard to find. I've had a lot of these cars and they always sell very well for me. So anytime I get a chance to buy one that's as nice as this one, I try to snatch them up as quick as I can. <clears throat> now these cars have a lot of unique features on them. The tail lights, the reverse lights, the fins, and as you know, they are a hard top retractable convertible. That's why they're called the Skyliners. Now this car, it also has a set of uh, true spoke, chrome spoke wheels on it, which I think they look great. They're they're uh, riding on a set of Firestone tires. The tires are in great condition as well. The stainless, the bright work, and all the chrome on this car is in very good shape. A couple little minor little dings in the chrome you might find, um, but otherwise it's in very, very good condition. Now this car is mostly original. I believe the odometer says 71,000 miles. Sorry, 79,000 miles, and they are supposed to be original miles. I mean, I know it's an old car. We can't verify or do a Carfax on it, but we uh, do believe that the miles are actual. The door panels and interior is all original in the car. The carpet seems to be all original as well. Um, just a very, very nice example of a 59 Ford retractable. The seats are in very, very good shape as well the back seat is in good shape as well it has all the factory seat belts in it your door jams are in nice shape the paint looks good on the door jams is this car a perfect car no it's not perfect it's very very nice very very high quality driver car i mean i have one up in the showroom that i'm asking eighty thousand dollars for and it's a hundred percent NCRS show winner car. I mean, this car, you'll take this car to local car shows and your church car shows and, and you'll win trophies in this car. Absolutely beautiful red paint job on the car. But this car is going to be affordably priced. Um, I haven't uh, pinned down the exact dollar amount I'm going to ask for this car yet, but it will be affordable. There's the driver's side. Same way your door jams are in good shape. Um, steering wheels in good shape your instrument cluster is all there and all complete we'll start it up here in a little bit I haven't even tried the uh, top on this car yet so try that together now this driver's side door glass does have a crack in it I did not even notice that when I bought the car because the prior owner had the window down on it and I didn't even know it but it does have a crack in it which it's not going to hurt the car any but you know, if you wanted to get that fixed, flat glass is very easy, very cheap to replace. So I'm going to start the car up and we'll hear a run. Oops. You know the horn works. Both the blinkers work there. Huh? Both the blinkers work. There, so you can see underneath there. 
The car is equipped with power steering. The, uh, the heater blower inside does work. All the dash lights work on this car. As you can see, you can put your camera in there and see the dash lights work. The blower motor works. The radio comes on. I, I think maybe it needs to warm up a little bit before I turn that on. goes down the road nice too like I say all the lights and gauges seem to work on this car beautiful car um, 